What's up guys, Greedy and Fi, and we're at Terminal 21 Mall, we gotta run some errands. I've been looking for water shoes, and I cannot find any of the right size, all these different places I've been to. So we're gonna look for those, and we're gonna hang out a little bit. Then we're gonna go eat at this really cool restaurant in Jong Tien. You gotta see this place, it's, it's a cool place. The food's good, but I mean the atmosphere and just, just you'll see what I'm talking about. It's really cool. It's it's definitely a must go to place when you're in uh, Puttia, and it's Western and Thai food. So I think you guys enjoy seeing that place. Oh, look, guys, some sort of festival or something. Here. Look at this guy's at the mall, there's some sort of festival going on. Let's check out the food here. So it's like a little mini market, like they kind of made it like a street food market in here. Holy cow, look at all this food. What is this called? Salabao. Salabao? Oh, the banh mi, that's the Vietnamese sandwich. I always get them mixed up because that looks like a bun. Uh oh, what's this? What the heck? What is this, babe? Snack. Okay, what are these over here? Bye. What is this? What's it called? Taco Yaki. Taco yaki? Oh, yeah, here. Taco yaki. Is this Japanese or Thai? It's Japanese. Which kind do you want? Get, uh, get a cheese. How many do you have to buy? Um, five or five. Okay, so get, um, <laughs> give me one shrimp and one cheese and then you get whatever you want. I think I might get a roti too. What kind do you have? You have uh, banana? What kind? What flavor? No. Oh, coconut. Oh. No. I'm not in the coconut roti. I like banana or cheese. Not getting coconut. Okay, so we found a place that might have them. They have size 40. They have two choices. They have like 40. 40? Oh, you have? You have low? Low cut? Okay. Yeah. Look at that. Walk right in and they have it. Yeah. Here, let's see if they fit. I gotta get these guys because uh, last time I went swimming, it was really rocky and I cut my foot. So I gotta get these. Size 40, these look small. Last one of the 41, I turned Oh, no. Yeah, baby. Perfect, right. Chai. Yeah. These are uh, chucks, huh? Oh, size seven men. Huh. I never saw these with like, like, um, wow. Yeah, I kind of like these. Yeah. What's, what's the advantage of high? Why high? Ah, for jet ski, you can ride it. You can wear this one for jet ski. All right, I'll get the tie. I get these, yeah. Okay. Good cut. So, yeah, I do plan on doing some jet skiing. I don't know. I had a jet ski before. I never had water shoes like that, but they actually felt really good, and I think they'll stay on a lot better. Yeah, can I told you. Can you swim with these? Yeah. Okay. Babe, I told you, then you go get it. Oh, for Kitty? I mean, for, for you. Oh. <laughs> Oh, and this one is she bird. Babe, I don't know where my phone is. Huh? Where's my phone? I tape it. <laughs> it's not fine. <laughs> <laughs> I get her every time. 
Okay, so those water shoes, 875 baht. Gotta do what you gotta do. I mean, I've had a hard enough time finding shoes that fit me. We go to outlet, but they don't have it. So while we're here, we're also gonna stop uh, in the food land, because it's kind of, they have some Western things here. And last time we went shopping, Fi couldn't find her um, olive oil spray, like, you know, sp like Pam spray on stuff. So hopefully they have it here. There it is. So where were we at before? At Big C and they didn't have that. I get to, what the hell. Oh, they got this, it's Crisco too. What is that? Uh, it's just a, no, I get this one. This is real out, okay. No, All right, it's the right. same, same. You happy? Yay, show them what you got. All right, let's see if they have my roll, my okay. correct okay. deodorant here. Okay, so they do have a couple of deodorant sticks, and that's what I use. And actually, they have deodorant mineral stick. Pure classic mineral stick, huh? I might try this, because I don't want antiperspirant. I get the... I'll try this one. What the hell? Because usually I get the um, Arm & Hammer or whatever. See in Thailand, mostly they got the uh, the wet kind or the spray. It's it's pretty hard to find the sticks, and this is all they got. And I can't have antiperspirant, so I'm gonna try this out. Maybe I'll uh, give you guys a review on this. Okay, guys. So I don't know how I didn't see it. They got the Old Spice. It's one of the kinds that I use. Right next to it, this is the uh, fresh deodorant, no antiperspirant. So this is the kind I'm getting. I thought I was gonna have to order it online. Here, give me that other one, babe. Let me, uh, I'm gonna get, I don't need that. All right, guys, no review on this. I'm getting my regular deodorant. I usually use this or the uh, Arm & Hammer, so. Bam! Greeny is a happy camper. If you need Western deodorant, Foodland. Hopefully this is good information. So if I was looking at uh, air fresheners she's obsessed with air fresheners but the funny thing is she had a motorbike accident when she was very young and she has no sense of smell her nose got injured <laughs> she can't smell anything i mean i can lay the deadliest um flatulence out right next to her and she doesn't smell i guess that's a good thing about having a girlfriend with no sense of smell is uh all the time. yeah and i don't even have to worry about it but why are you why do you buy air fresheners i just want to smell good but but how do you know if it smells good or not? Because I don't know if it smells bad or not. That's why I keep pushing it. All right, let's go. Come on. And, yeah, I can't smell your fire, but I can't hear you, okay? Stop well, talking. Sometimes it's silent. All right, guys, one more shopping tip that I'm going to mention to you guys is uh, when you cash out and use a credit card, make sure you tell them you want it in Thai bot. Let Visa do the conversion because you get a really good rate with Visa. If you let them do the conversion, you get their rate and you get jacked every time I've seen it. One, one place didn't ask me and they didn't give me the Thai bot, they converted it and I lost about a dollar. I mean, I lost, how much did I lose? Uh, I well, like instead of 31 bot, it was 30 bot. So I lost a bot per dollar. Whatever, just a tip guys, pro tip here. So while we're here at Central Festival, I wanna show you guys like a, a total Thai thing. And uh, I've never seen this in America, but here they have these parking spots that block cars in. But what people do is you just leave your car in neutral. And when these people come to their car, they can push your car out of the way to get out of their spot, which I've never seen that before. Just in Thailand. Don't do that. When have you crashed into the car? Oh, okay. <laughs> so they didn't do it. They didn't leave it in neutral like they're supposed to. Too heavy for you? So what happens if some little lady gets in her car? How's she gonna security, security yeah. will do it? Okay. Just just something new that I've never seen before you know until what? except for Thailand. What? <laughs> we're not in central. We're in terminal. Oh yeah, we're at terminal twenty one. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, today we're eating lunch at Cafe 35 over in Jomtien, South Pattaya. 
another place Phi found. Looks like a cute little place. Hopefully they have good food. We already had coffee, so I don't know what uh, I don't know what she has planned. I'll show you guys this on the map. What a cup. So I'm gonna show you guys this menu here at Cafe 35, but it's pretty hard to concentrate on the menu. Look at these monsters. These fish are gigantic in this little koi pond here. So anyways, some quesadillas. Even love it. What? Okay. My menu just got hijacked. Which is what? Oh, kalsoy? Mm. Oh, I might have to get kalsoy. I was gonna get the uh, spinach. I was gonna get the spinach quesadilla, but she just showed me kalsoy. German pork hocks. Oh, they have pizza too. Okay, uh, kalsoy. Let me show you guys around this place. It's pretty nice. All right, so this is the inside of the place. Pretty nice. Hello, hello, ladies. Yeah, they got a lot of people working in here. Nice. This place is so cool. Some people eating here. I don't know about it. Huh? So a little inside air kind of area, and there's a lot of area outside here. Get our drinks. What'd you get there? Mango smoothie? Yeah. Wow. I got the Italian ice. No, why do I keep saying Italian ice? It's Italian soda here. There's a thing Italian ice. How is yours? What'd you 
get? Pretty good. Pork, head to you. Chiang Mai. That's the first place I ever had it. It's like regular wet noodles and then crispy dry noodles with some chicken and like a northern Thailand curry sauce. They also give you these pickled vegetables which add a nice extra dimension to it. Onions. And what is this? Is this like a hot sauce or what is this? Mm -hmm. How hot is it? It's trying to push. Like you have to try his food before you put it in. I don't want it in at all. Alright, so you add your pickled vegetables, you add your onions. I'll try it, maybe I'll put a tiny bit of that uh, chili paste in it. That was stupid to eat that. That's like uh, eating straight up ghost peppers or something. So this one's like a curry with a little bit of sweetness. Let's try the chicken. Chicken's just falling off the bone. Mm. That chicken feels like it was like slow roasted for a day. It's so soft, falling off the bones. And actually, the sauce already has a little bit of chili kick in it, so let me see. It's spicy enough for me already, I don't need it, but a little bit of spiciness with it, with those pickled vegetables, you know, the spicy, sweet, and sour of this dish is amazing. This is one of my favorite Thai dishes there is. And this is pretty good, pretty good adaptation of the dish. Not the best I ever had, but decent. Drinks 408 baht, about 12 bucks US. Pretty good for an atmosphere like this. Let's see. I think I. So I gotta tell you guys, uh, if you're looking for a place with a really nice atmosphere here in Zhongtian. This is nice. Ty is getting really good at picking these places. She knows what kind of places I like. Like these real, you know, cool places with great atmosphere. You know, so good job today, Fi. Gritty out. 